गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स जनरल साइंस क्लास एट चैप्टर टू हेल्थ एंड डिफिजेस पार्ट वन डियर स्टूडेंट्स इन दिस चैप्टर वी लर्न अबाउट हेल्थ डिफीज एंड वेरियस types of diseases have you have you ever some time taken a leave from school because of sickness you will find that yes many times you have taken leave from the school because of sickness then what happens actually when you are sick can you describe no during sickness you have to take proper medicines under the supervision of doctor and sometimes you cure without taking medicine then why is it for because you because your health is not good because you are suffering from the diseases any may be now let's learn what is the meaning of health हेल्थ इज अ व्री वास्ट कन्सेप्ट हेल्थ इज अ व्री वास्ट आइडिया बिकॉज हेल्थ इंक्लूड्स फिजिकल हेल्थ हेल्थ इंक्लूड मेंटल हेल्थ इट इंक्लूड सोशल हेल्थ वॉट इज द डेफिनेशन ऑफ हेल्थ health is a state of complete physical mental and social well beingness of person and not only the absence of disease and hence health is a very fast concept if your physical health is good if your mental health is good you are not suffering from any mental stress and your social health is good then and only then you say that your health is good then why our health is not good for long time what is the reason for sickness the answer is disease many diseases because of many diseases our health is not good then let's see what is the disease many diseases are causes to the women and many plants because of some pathogens what are the pathogens the microorganisms which causes various kinds of diseases to the persons are called as pathogens so what is the disease the diff the disturbance of processes the disturb the disturbance of physiological or psychological processes of body are called as disease the condition of disturbance in 
फिजियोलॉजिकल और फाइकोलॉजिकल प्रोफेस ऑफ बॉडी आर कॉल्ड एज डिफिजेस एंड डिफिजेस आर कॉज बाय वेरियस पैथोजन्स यू नो वेरियस डिफिजेस टाइफाइड मलेरिया डायबिटीज कैंसर हार्ट डिफिजेस Each disease has a specific reason. Every disease has specific symptoms. Every disease has a specific treatment. If you make the list of these diseases, then it may be very long because the number of diseases are too much. so to study them properly we require the classification of diseases and hence the next topic is type of diseases type of diseases the diseases are classified according to first diseases are classified by two means number 1 according to duration and according to reason according to duration there are two types of diseases number 1 acute diseases and number 2 chronic diseases then what is acute diseases the diseases which which duration is a very small very short are called as acute diseases these diseases cure within short period of time for example for fever malaria typhoid are the acute diseases because they get cure shortly and number 2 chronic diseases what are the chronic diseases the the diseases whose duration is very long are called as chronic diseases sometimes they are not cured until a life for example cancer heart diseases are the various chronic diseases Friends, according to duration, there are two types of diseases: acute diseases and chronic diseases. This is the first type, and the next type is the diseases according to reasons. Diseases according to reason. According to reason, diseases are classified into two types: hereditary diseases and acquired diseases. Now let's see the hereditary diseases. What are the hereditary diseases? The diseases which are transmitted from parent to offspring are called as hereditary diseases. The diseases which are transferred or transmitted from parent to offspring are called as hereditary diseases. or the diseases which are transmitted from one generation to another generation are also called as hereditary diseases down syndrome is one of the hereditary diseases then then next type acquired diseases the diseases which are caused by loss of immunity power of the person are called as acquired diseases there are two type of acquired diseases there are two type of acquired diseases number 1 infectious diseases and number 2 non infectious diseases now let's learn what are the infectious diseases the diseases 
which are spread through the contaminated water or contaminated food or contaminated air or vectors like infect and other animals are called as infectious diseases the diseases which are spread through contaminated air contaminated water contaminated food or vectors by vectors like infect and other animals are called as infectious diseases for example typhoid cholera tuberculosis are the various infectious diseases and number 2 non infectious diseases the diseases which are not spread through the infections are called as non infectious diseases it means the diseases which are which does not spread through the contaminated air through the contaminated water or through the contaminated food or vectors like infect and animals are called as non infectious diseases for example cancer heart diseases are the various examples of non infectious diseases thank you very much